It has been a hot issue within the resort city for some time. And tonight, Virginia Beach City Council met to discuss and vote on updating the regulations for short term rentals. News 3 reporter Zach Dahlheimer live for us in Virginia Beach at tonight's meeting. So, Zach, such a thorny issue. Are we any closer to a vote? Not yet, Kurt. For two hours now, we've had just public comment from many residents living in Virginia Beach voicing uh, how they feel about this ordinance. Uh, they have a, you have a lot of strong sides, uh, both for and against this ordinance. It's a very emotional topic, and this comes after complaints of partying and noise. But let's break down the latest proposal that's at stake. It calls for them to only be allowed in three areas. We're talking the North End, Oceanfront, and Sandbridge. Sandbridge, however, follows a different part of the law allowing property owners more leeway in listing their properties. In terms of the north end and ocean front, they would be put into so-called overlay districts. Property owners then could apply for a conditional use permit to operate their home as short-term rentals. Now, some people we talked with in the north end don't want that area into, don't want the area into a uh, district where these types of rentals are allowed. They would not be allowed in other parts of the city unless they're grandfathered in, but people living in different areas could petition the city to become an overlay district. Now, here are some residents who voiced how they feel about the ordinance at tonight's meeting. The market is going to keep on rolling. The question is, who do you want running the industry? Good citizens who are willing to apply and comply or operators who do not care what the city wants. If this passes and holds in five years, I will definitely be out of business. We want reasonable, responsible and enforceable guidelines so that everyone can experience STRs as a positive contribution to the community. The proposed short-term rental overlay in the Oceanfront Resort District may be a practical and reasonable approach in, in that commercial district. However, both you and the Planning Commission rightly recognize that STR Now, Kurt, the ordinance would also add regulations aimed at addressing safety concerns. The city council still addressing this issue at this time. We have a live feed here. It looks like the city council members are talking with residents still in public comment. Now, as I said, for nearly two hours, they've been discussing this issue. The public has in front of the city council. But, of course, we'll keep you posted on the, on the vote later on WTKR.com. Live in Virginia Beach, Zach Dahlheimer, News 3.